Well, we've just arrived for today's adventure at Button Rock Preserve. It's just outside Lyons in Colorado. We got here a little before eight because I was afraid the parking lot would fill up. It's a really popular trail. We were the second car here and there's more folks rolling in. So we are gonna go ahead and hit the trail. Button Rock Preserve is actually owned by the city of Longmont. And there is a trail up and around the reservoir that is about seven miles. So it's a little bit longer than what I've been doing. And dogs are still allowed, but I hear they're gonna change that. So we didn't bring forest this morning, just me and Andy. And we're gonna head up that way. It is late April and you can see there's a little bit of snow on the ground. We actually had, I think about two or three inches probably up here the other day and it melted off pretty quickly, but it is chilly this morning. It's only about 27 degrees right now, and hopefully it'll get up to low 40s, but good morning for a brisk walk. So the trail starts on this road, and we actually had to drive about three miles up the dirt road to get here, but in a little bit, we'll be veering off and actually be on real single track trail up the ridge and around the mountain, I think. That's our turn off. Right, we start going up a little bit. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I don't think we could have asked for a better morning to be out here. It is gorgeous. And so far, no crabs at all. Kind of hoping we might get lucky and see some wildlife. We saw some Canada goose down there and some deer on the way in, but so far that's it. I believe that some of those views may be into Rocky Mountain National Park. Lost Andy in the rocks up there. A lot of places here where people come to climb in addition to hike. Whew. I'm not winded at all. <laughs> Just came up a bit of a climb. This gorgeous meadow. Where? Oh, look at that. Those mule deer?
lot of viewpoints on this trail. We have seen a few other hikers, I think six to be exact. So I'm glad we got out early. There's plenty of time to stop and enjoy the views. I think that's Long's Peak up there that Andy's taking a picture of. I just emerged from those rocks and I came around the bend and look what I see. There's a reservoir right down there. Isn't that pretty? Well, I was just telling Andy how much I am thoroughly enjoying this trail and what a blessing it is to be out here in the end of April, enjoying cool weather, a little bit of snow on the ground, not too much. Get that in the southeast, definitely not in Florida, so I'm savoring. We're gonna kind of go around the reservoir, but not down to it. And the trail is way over there, so we're heading that way. did a bit of a loop around the end here. We can look over and see those beautiful rocks that we were just climbing on. Look how high they are. They're heading onward. Downhill for a little bit. I wonder what that roaring noise is that there is a spillway of sorts. couple that passed us a little while ago is hiking across the dam now and we are not sure if that's part of our trail or not but we're gonna carry on downhill down what used to be an old road used to be a road we passed over bits of pavement Looks like we are actually beneath the dam. There's a water release happening. All that snow melt has to go somewhere. We're not entirely sure we're on the right trail, but we've been doing some road walking and passing a lot of hikers past a sign that said to the parking lot. So maybe we're heading that way. Maybe we missed a turn. Not really sure, but looks like we'll find out soon. You still having fun? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we've established that we are at least heading in the right direction towards the parking lot. Although we didn't plan on this much road walking. 
but lesson learned. We decided if we want to do this trail again, we'll go up to where we got the great views of the dam and turn around and go back so we can stay on more backwoods kind of trail. This is a popular area for fly fishing, as you can see down there. Well, it looks like we've completed our loop. The trail that we went up is over there. So we are now officially doubling back on the stick of the lollipop, heading towards the parking lot. Shadow of some very big rocks. And I also think that we are almost back to the car. 